Well, hi, I'm Mark with Home Sear, and uh, we're at the CD. Uh, we're actually at the CES 2014 Expo. We happen to be in the Z-Wave Alliance Pavilion. Uh, we've been an Alliance member for many years now, and uh, we are showing a couple of things. We introduced our Home Troller Z uh, back in October of last year, and uh, we've added a couple of two new, uh, really interesting features to the to the uh, Z. One is that we now do voice programming, and you can do that by tele by uh, phone. So, for example, a lot of companies will do direct device control. In other words, turn the light on or adjust the thermostat. That's direct device control. We do voice programming, which nobody else does. And the great thing about voice programming is you'll do events that you might not otherwise bother with because it might take too much time to go into the web interface. So what you could say is, for example, you could pick up your phone and say, on Saturday at 4.30 p.m., turn the outside lights on for three hours. Underneath, what the Z does is it creates an automation event, schedules it for Saturday at 4.30, and then when that, take, uh, that date comes, it executes the event. In the case of that specific event, it deletes itself when it's done, so you don't have a lot of clutter. For other events, that you want to have occur every day, you could say, every day at sunset, turn the outside lights on. In that case, it creates a persistent event that always stays. So voice programming, uh, very simple to do, and it gives you an opportunity cr to create an event that you might otherwise not bother with because it might take too much time. But by voice, it's very simple and very quick. Other thing that we're adding, the other thing we're talking about uh, at, at the show here is that we do uh, automatic <laughs> camera discovery now. Well, so if you have, uh, for example, a Foscam camera, uh, IP camera on your local network, uh, whereas it used to be a lot of configuration to set that camera up, now Homesear finds the cameras automatically and, and again, you pick up your phone, uh, you can go to the camera page. If you've got five cameras in your house, five cameras are going to display in the uh, interface. You just select the one that you want to view, and there it is. So two great new features that we're adding, and uh, we're pretty excited about it.